of Humanity. This is the penalty. This is um, Penal TV, Season 2, Episode 3. And, well, I don't have a particular topic I want to discuss today. Um, a friend of mine was over earlier. We w- had gotten to talking about the damn universe and shit, smoking a few L's or whatnot. And it's like, damn, like, what could be out there? You know what I'm saying? Like, it's got to be something living on those planets out there. Like, you know what I'm saying? For somebody to sit here and say that there's no intelligent life outside of Earth is a fucking idiot, man. I mean, shit, they might get mad and shit. It could be people close to me who believe this shit. But, hey, man, it is what it is. It's like, (laughs) it's got to be some other life out there, man. Because, yo, (laughs) and most people don't even think of this type of shit. Like, most people are just, just like, basically stuck in in they little town and shit all they care about is what's going on in in the town and who's going to the club friday night and shit they don't think about like what's going on in in the country more or less what's going on in the world more or less what's going on in the goddamn universe (laughs) you know all these other planets out here you know it's got to be some shit out here like Basically, like, I feel like all our mysteries, all the mysteries of life and everything, like, anything that we haven't figured out yet has to be out there. It has to be. It's either out there or it's on Earth protected by the government. Protected heavily by the motherfucking government. Those cocksuckers. (laughs) Yeah, they probably got the answers and shit because they got the money, they got the technology. So I'm pretty sure they haven't told us everything that, you know, that they know and shit that they discovered or whatnot on their findings and shit. But for the, you know, there's got to be some shit out there, man. There's a lot of mysteries about the world. There's a lot of mysteries about the universe. There's there's a lot of mysteries about... other universes, if there is another universe out there, I'm pretty sure there is. You know what I'm saying? There's a, a another group of planets out there probably that we haven't even fucking discovered that we'll probably never discover. What I feel like, I feel like it's cool to go to these planets if we can. We got the technology and we got the suits to wear to survive and all that shit. But I feel like if we're not naturally able to survive out there, you know what I'm saying? Out any of those planets like Mercury, Venus, Mars, you know, what I'm saying Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, Neptune, blah, blah, blah. You know. How the fuck. How the fuck we going to survive out those planets without some special type of equipment? You know what I mean? I feel like. We're not we're not we're not meant to know certain things about life and certain things about out there, intelligent life outside of this planet and and maybe you know saying whatever's out there aliens or whatever first and foremost i don't believe that aliens are just green with big ass heads and big ass black eyes and you know saying just ugly as fuck like man they probably look just like us with like an extra limb or some shit you know what i'm saying like my man off a total recall and shit but um yo it's got to be some shit out there for real and I don't believe anything that these TVs is telling us. I don't believe anything that our school teachers told us. You know, even though a lot of that shit is still in my head and I'm trying to get all that shit out. I'm trying to unlearn all of that shit and relearn new shit, you know, more accurate shit if possible, you know. And I I just I don't I don't trust not, I don't trust the media period, man. I don't trust the school systems, I don't trust the justice system, I don't trust any type of system you know what i mean i don't trust that shit and i have every motherfucking right not to trust that shit and if they smart they better not trust me (laughs) not them anyway i'm crooked motherfuckers (laughs) for real but uh man i can ramble about the government all day and what what they hide from us certain secrets and shit that 
we'll never probably ever discover in our lifetime. Whatever's out there, you know, outside of Earth, like, I'm pretty sure there's going to come to a time where we're going to be able to, to, you know, to migrate to another planet or whatever, but I don't think it's any time soon. And if it is sometime soon, then, you know, I would like to, I I like to be a part of it to an extent. You know, I'm pretty sure the government going to have their hands all over that shit. And, you know, it's going to be some strings attached and things ain't going to be what they say they're going to be. You know, you just got to accept the fact that the people in control of this world are liars. And there's a lot of things that we need to fucking know about, you know, like, man, it's just, it's just a lot of things we got to know about, you know, life in general, man. Is there a God? Is there this, that, and the third? Is there an afterlife? You know, I'm pretty sure they, they might not know that shit themselves, but, you know, my whole thing is, and a lot of people are, are not going to agree with that, and that's fine because I don't need their, you know what I'm saying, approval or anything like that. But I feel like there's certain things about life and death that we as human beings are not meant to understand and fully understand and, you know what I'm saying, and be able to, like, convey to other people you know i just feel like certain things just have to be left with a question mark you know as as much as it feels like it's an itch that we can't scratch and it really is but the human body is not designed to explore the universe without some type of technology you know like just naturally we, we can't breathe in space we can't you know what i'm saying and these these planets they they so fucking far man it takes years and years to get to the motherfucking planets man like man it's not even worth trying to like explore the universe like that but at the same time like curiosity has to go you know be in somebody else besides me you know i i would love to see what's on these other planets out here and not just with the TVs and and you know what i'm saying the school systems and these textbooks that the kids are learning nowadays like I want to know the truth about shit. I don't want to know what another motherfucker done wrote down and shit and programmed everybody to believe. I don't I don't want to know that shit. I want to unlearn that shit. You know what I'm saying? Because that's the shit that I was growing up to motherfucking believe, and I don't like that shit. You know, I want to develop my own beliefs, which I do have my own beliefs, but I want to develop more fucking knowledge about what's going on out here. And I feel like the human brain can never learn too much like the human brain is so fucking incredible man like you can never learn too much and for any of you motherfuckers out there who think that y'all can't learn anything else that's the dumbest thing that i I could ever fucking hear from anybody man like how the fuck would you say something like that really (laughs) man like man you, you can learn anything from anybody man somebody younger than you older than you you know hell you might learn something from another species might not be through words of course but it might be through you know actions you know what i mean because everybody's connected some way somehow you know nobody's just totally disconnected with everything and everybody you know in every way shape or form no everybody's connected some way and somehow the thing is everybody have their own opinion of what, of how everybody is connected. And I just feel like there's nothing wrong with having your own opinion, but don't follow another person's opinion. Develop your own opinion, you know? Don't follow somebody else's lead, man. You fucking, you know what I'm saying, run into a brick wall with them and shit. You don't, you don't need that in your life, you know what I mean? It's just so many mysteries about the universe, man. And I just wish that, I wish that the government would, would like, not not just the government in general, but just, uh, just the way life is. It's like, nobody can afford a fucking spaceship. You know what I'm saying? I don't know anybody right now that could build one from scratch or anything like that. You know what I'm saying? The only ones who got technology like that is NASA. It's the motherfucking government. They got that shit. You know, 
So if somebody like me and you was to try to build a spacecraft and lead a planet, we going to get shot the fuck down before we even lead this planet. You know what I'm saying? They See, the thing is, there are a lot of beautiful things out there in the universe. It has to be. And that there are a lot of answers to our questions out there in the universe. It has to be. But the thing is, even if we did have the right materials to lead this planet, you actually think the government going to let us do that shit? You know what I'm saying? No, they're not going to do that, man. So it's like we're just confined, basically, in one planet in the whole universe, you know? And still, and still, everybody, well, not everybody, but a lot of people are walking around feeling like they fully understand the universe and that, you know what I'm saying, like they got the answers to all the motherfucking questions and that shit right there, <laughs> that shit right there, man, that's that know-it-all shit, man. It's like, how the fuck can you know too much? You can never learn too much. Ever. <laughs> man, learning never stops, man. Education is a lifelong process, man. A lifelong process. Word up, man. And I'm going to keep learning and learning and learning. I'm addicted to learning, man. And I know I'm not the only one who feel that way. I'm I'm addicted to learning. Like, I have to learn something new every day. If I didn't learn something new today or tomorrow or, or any day, I feel like I failed at something. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got to learn something, man. I got to fucking learn. You know, I got to learn, man. But there's so many people in, on this planet who don't fucking think about that shit, who don't concentrate on trying to learn something new every day who don't concentrate on what's going on outside of America or outside of their city or state. You know, like, people don't concentrate on shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, everybody's just concentrated on, on what the government wants them to be concentrated on. But then, you know, but not me. I'm different from everybody else. You know, that's why a lot of times I feel like I'm alone in the universe. You know, because very seldom I run into somebody who thinks the way I think. You know, it's not an everyday thing. You know, and I try to hold on to these people, these like minded people, because you're not going to run into that many like minded motherfuckers when, when you're thinking on some deep shit like how I think on. So I try to hold on to these people as long as I can. You know, of course, if they do some grimy shit, you got to let them go. You know, you can't just hold on to somebody like a sucker. But. um, Yeah, I try to I try to like find like minded people to make me feel less crazy in this world because everybody around me is just so fucking different. I just feel like a fucking alien or some shit, man. <laughs> you know, I discussed that shit a lot on the first season. I'm not going to really, like, delve into that shit, you know. But, yeah, this is the third episode of season two of Penal TV. This is the penalty. Adios. <laughs>